and welcome back to my channel. I am the Honey Bat if this is your first time here. One of the most common requests I get are to do some of the lost kitties. So here we have some from series two. We have 10 cartons. Before I start opening these, I just wanna say please do not give your cats milk. I don't know why toy companies insist on putting carrots with bunnies and cats with milk, but kitty cats really should not drink milk in real life after they are no longer kittens. And if you wanna see my kitty cats at the end of this video, stay tuned after we pick favorites because I will be posting some there. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. They open just like those school milk cartons. We can see one kitty cat there. And there's a little sneak peek. We can't really see much, so we're gonna open this up. This looks like it's probably going to be a checklist. And it says, who did you find hiding inside? So here's a bunch of our kitty cats that we can get. And on this side, it's like a little poster. I like the one right there in the shopping bag. That's what my cats like to do. Inside, we found some chocolate milk. I think we're supposed to peel this off. And this is, okay, this is like Play-Doh. It's gonna get stuck underneath my fingernails. I'm gonna grab an LOL ball here to put our Play-Doh in as we try to dig out our blind bag. I don't see any tear strips, so we're gonna go ahead and use our little snippers over here. This is a big one. This kitty cat is Olga. She is from the Noms collection, and she is in this little clear bowl. Her big tail is hanging over the side. If we look down in here, we have some other stuff. We have something blue. We have a little tiny tin of popcorn. Maybe this is what was supposed to be in the bowl before she climbed in. Oh, you can actually hear my kitty cat joining us for this video. And down in the very bottom, we have a sticker. And it is of Olga, and it says, I is popcorn. This reminds me of the Lulz Cat website. I used to visit it all the time. I think it came out back when I was in high school. We also have another piece stuck into our Play-Doh, or our modeling compound, whatever we want to call it. And it is a little purple teapot that still has stuff stuck all over it. And we'll go ahead and check it and see if there's anything else in there. feel any other little pieces. This is extremely soft and squishy. So it's very nice to actually touch. I just don't like it underneath my fingernails. That was a great way to start this video. We're going to go on to the one right next to it. Go ahead and pop it open the same way. Another checklist. And this time we have some white compound. We'll go ahead and peel that off. We have our little bowl back. Usually we use our snippers, but this time we're gonna use a scooper and flip it all over the desk. See, here is our bag. We have to free it. There we go. This looks like it's the one from the box and it has bat wings. This is the perfect lost kitty for us to find. His name is Booger, and he is from the hashtag Adorbs collection. He's got little bat wings. I just can't get over it. Okay, so let's see what else he comes with down there in our modeling compound. We can see something blue down here in the corner. And it is a little blue jack-o'-lantern, so a little bit of a Halloween theme. And if we pull all this out, we have something purple down here. It looks like a little bicycle horn. And Booger's sticker says, I is the night. And he's got his little bat wings pulled up over himself. If we're going to get any duplicates in this video, I would love a duplicate of him. Moving right along to box number three. We have another new color. This is gonna be some pink clay. So here we go, we have bright pink. I think it's 
supposed to be like strawberry milk, but it, it's a little bright for that. We have our blind bag buried down in there. We are back to our snippers to get this little blind bag open and see which kitty cat we have. This little kitty's name is Munch. He is from the hashtag Pure Bliss. He's got all these different snacks there. He's even got his little tail on the back. We'll finish taking that off. We have something down here in the bottom that looks green. We have a little green package, and I bet if it's a present for him, it's going to be more food. And we should have a second thing in there. There it is, it's blue. I feel like I'm scooping out ice cream. His other accessory is this little notebook. It's still got some clay stuck on it, but I'm gonna clean those up before the end of the video. Munch's sticker is this one here of him sitting on a couch and it says, you got some more snacks? Now we are bound to get a duplicate color of clay because I think there are only the three. And this one is going to be a chocolate. There we go. We're going to see if we can't just squish this one out. I've heard some people say that they can. Yay! So there's our sticker. We're just going to hide that for now because it's going to tell us who we have. Our first accessory is a little cat tower with a little toy, so like a little scratch post. We also get what appears to be like a giant cupcake, maybe a bowl of spaghetti. I am not really sure on this one. So here we go. This is Sir Stinks a lot. He is also from hashtag Pure Bliss. I'm guessing that makes this a little basket of laundry. But here he is with a hopefully clean sock. What is it with cats and socks? My cats love them. He's got little pointy ears. He is absolutely cute. And it looks like it was a clean sock because his sticker says, so fresh, so queen. I wish my cats would help out with the laundry. That would make my life so much easier. Here we go on number five. This will mean that we are halfway done. We have another white compound. So we're just gonna peel this on back. And like last time, we are going to try to squish out our clay. We're not having such great luck this time, so we're just gonna go ahead and pull the top piece out. This is Boops. He has fallen over. He is from the Hashtag Catholic Club. And he kind of sleeps like my cats do, all bent out of shape. If any of you own a cat, then you know how they can lay any way that they like. They're practically liquid. It looks like he's holding something in there between his paws, even though at first I thought he had like a big mustache. If we go down here underneath the rest of this clay, we can see our accessories. So here is another one of the little cat posts that we got in the last one. This one is blue. And it looks like we also have a little trophy that is really stuck in there. There we go. A little trophy. I am really glad that these stickers are wrapped in plastic. Otherwise, they would be completely ruined by the time we got them out of there. And this is precious. We are halfway done and I have washed my hands again, so we are ready for another one. Oh, I didn't realize this side was different. So this says squad goals and here we have munch instead of booger. And inside we have some white compound. We're gonna peel this back, take out our scooper and get down to that blind bag. Or maybe a little past it. We have another purple kitty cat. This is Sid. He is from hashtag not feeling it or not feeling it. He looks like he is deep in thought because cat's lives are so hard. If we dig a little bit deeper into this clay, we should find our two little accessories. Here we have a duplicate teapot. It is also the same color. 
And this is a duplicate journal, but it is a new color. This is the first sticker we can actually see through our wrapping. This says, what's to do next? The answer to said sticker is, of course, another lost kitty. So we're gonna turn it this way and go ahead and open up our box. We have some chocolate clay. Here we go. Here we don't go. All right, let's try that again. We're getting somewhere. Here is the blind bag and our snippers. And we have a little teal kitty. This little cutie cat is Tubby Tubs, and it looks like it's a little loaf cat, which is how my kitty cats here like to sleep. He has a teal body with little like seafoam green stripes. If we open up his sticker, we'll have to cut that out of the bag. So we'll look at his accessories first. He is also from the Nums collection. We have a little loaf of bread. And the second one over here is going to be another little horn. If this isn't a horn, please tell me in the comments below. That's the only thing I can think of. And Tubby Tubbs' sticker says, just loafing around. Kitty cats are good at that. We have three cartons left. This one's gonna be another white one. So here we go, we're gonna peel that corner down. If anyone is wondering about my comments about bunny rabbits from earlier, bunnies are supposed to have a piece of carrot about this big once a week. They're kind of like us in chocolate. They're treats, but they're not meant to be eaten all the time. Most of their diet is supposed to be leafy greens. So I really hope no more companies put a carrot with every single bunny that they make. But let's see which kitty cat this is. Oh, it's a big yellow one. This is Sparkle Time, the kitty cat. He is from hashtag working it. He has these big glasses. You can see they go around his head. He also has a little tail. He's got some clay stuck to him. If we go down to the bottom of our clay, we should see a couple of extras. The first one that we have is the little green trophy. So there it is up close. It still has clay stuck in the little handles, but that's okay, we'll get that cleaned out later. And I can feel something else down in the bottom. There's our sticker. Oh, we have a new one. We have a little purple boom box or a radio. I used to have one that looked very similar. So there we go, our little kitty cats can listen to some awesome tunes. I have Butterfingers today. His sticker says, my vision's fine, as he's got his face pressed all the way up against the TV or computer screen. I think the real issue with sitting that close is that no one behind you can see, but I am not an eye doctor, so don't take my word for that. The sticker itself is really cute, though. We have two left. I would love to see someone from the Meowjik or perhaps the Woke Up Like This collection, but so far I really like all of the little kitty cats that we've found. And I think we have one from every other collection. Let's do this one for our ninth carton. We have more white compound. We're just gonna pull the corner off. And we'll just squish it. That's such a fun word to say, squish. All right, let's see who this is. Oh, this is our first duplicate. So we just got this one, this is Sparkle Time. We're gonna go ahead and check to see if he has duplicate accessories or not. It doesn't look like it. Here we have a little milk carton. We have another boom box, but this one is dark blue. But this sticker is the same, so I will get that out off camera. This is the last one for this video, so let's see if we can find a new kitty cat. And we have a pretty good shot, this is a pink one. I think we've only seen one of those this video, maybe two. Ugh, squish. All right, so here is Hoping. And we have a second munch. So because the other one didn't come with duplicate accessories, let's go ahead and see what this munch has in its container. We have either the basket of laundry or the cupcake, whichever one it wants to be. It is a purple present that is also covered in clay. 
and the sticker is the same as the first one, so again, I will just get that out later. Don't forget to stay tuned until the end of the video if you would like to see my kitty cats. And you gotta leave me a comment telling me who your favorite is. I think mine is obvious for this video. I love Booger, it's a little bat, you can't beat that. But a very, very close second is Munch. I just love that he is all about the snacks. So until next time, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you later. Bye for now.